Drugs damage our health and our society. Drugs cause addiction, overdoses, death. And the organized criminal networks that traffic the drugs undermine society with corruption and violence. To counter this dual threat, our two EU agencies are joining forces. Our drugs agency with its expertise on drug markets and Europol with its focus on security. Each doing what they do best, combining efforts and breaking down silos. With the EU Drug Markets Report, which offers key insights for policy and practice based on in-depth analysis and long-standing cooperation between the two agencies. As a policymaker, I rely on the expertise of the Drugs Agency and Europol. I make my policies based on facts. Like recently, the launch of the European Ports Alliance against drug trafficking, because it takes a network to fight a network. If you are a policymaker, decision maker, or practitioner, this report offers a quick overview of what you need to know. With key insights on drug markets, a constantly evolving market worth 30 billion euro in the European Union alone, with huge amounts and many different kinds of drugs available. And with the key developments on individual drugs, cannabis most commonly used, cocaine increasingly used, and synthetic drugs being produced in the EU itself. And the report also outlines actions against drug threats, actions to improve the intelligence picture, to reduce supply, strengthening international cooperation, capacity building, policy and healthcare responses. So I would like to thank Catherine de Bol and Alexis Gustil personally. And I thank Europol and the Drugs Agency for this report. I recommend this report to everyone who is designing or implementing drug policies, be it from the perspective of public health or security. I know it will help you to make a difference.